Hi guys, Assalamualaikum and Salam COVID-19 My name is Rivaldo Billy. So today I'll be doing my oral representation Whereby I'm going to talk about a song That represents one of the best decisions that I've made in my life So throughout this video, I'll be explaining the significance of the song By relating it to the events that have happened in my life So first of all, I'll be talking about the best decision that I've made so I have decided to further my study away from home. I am from Miri and I am and I have decided to further my study in Yudimas, Kota Samarahan, Sarawak. Even though Miri and Kota Samarahan is not that far, but for me it is quite a distance because I've never in I've never been in Kota Samarahan for quite a long time. Whereby I'm going to take about five years um, for my foundation year and my degree years. So next, I'll be talking about the song that represents this best decision of my life. First of all, I've chose uh, one of the songs from my favorite one of my favorite singer, which is Michael Bublé. Michael Bublé is a Canadian Italian singer whereby he released and record he record and release this song entitled Home in 2005. This song, uh, this, this song is so much related to the events that have happened in my life ever since I've become a fun, I, I, I've become a university student and being independent and away from my family. I'll be highlighting uh, certain lyrics that is so much related to the events that have happened in my life ever since I have made this best decision. So the lyric is, I've been keeping all the letters that I've wrote to you, H1, a line or two, and find baby Howard. So how this lyric is related to me is, whenever I'm feeling sad and emotional, when I miss my family, uh, I will listen to this song and whenever this lyric comes up, uh, it will remind me to just express, express my sad feelings uh, by jotting it down inside my notes. So I have jotted down a lot of feelings and emotional words or quotes ever, uh, ever since I keep on feeling sad. I have jotted it down inside the notes in my phone. So I was, uh, every time I am feeling sad and keep on thinking about my family and friends in Miri, I will reread the, the things that I have jotted down and indirectly the words and quotes will become the motivation for me to keep going because in the end, no matter what, I will be with them anyhow. So next, another line of the lyric is and I know just why you could not come along with me and that is not your dream but you always believed in me. How this is related to me is when my parent is not by my side and I have to get along for every day without them without any guidance and even during my registration day I registered along come along the way from Yuri to Kuching and ever since that moment I I have my day without my family by my side. So even though uh, I'm furring my study in Unimas is not one of the dreams for me but they always keep on trusting me so that I can do well in my study hence they always believe in me so that I will not get involved in social issues such that smoking, drinking alcohol and taking drugs um, so every time I woke up in the morning on my bed before taking shower and going to the campus I will set my goal and I will pray so that my parents will always keep the trust in me so that I can get along with the day and get, get my knowledge peacefully so that I can get a flying color result as a reward for them. So lastly, the last lyrics that I am going to highlight from this song is Maybe surrounded by a million people I still feel all alone. I just want to go home. So this is related to me whenever I am surrounded by my classmates and my lab mates or lecturers. I will still feel all alone because my family is not in front of my eyes or even my beloved best friends. So even there are a lot of people surround me but I am my I am not in Miri. I will feel all alone because my heart is in Miri and my body is in Unimas. 
you know when it comes to home it is not just a place it is a feeling a feeling of being home a, a peaceful feeling for when you get to see your beloved one in front of your eyes so before ending my presentation I would like to recommend Michael Bublé's songs for you because my, his song is not just being so much related to one's life but also we recall back the nostalgic, nostalgic events of the sweet memories whenever people listening to his songs his masterpiece is worth to be listened so um, by this I uh, will end my presentation by saying thank you to all of you and said this because willing to watch my videos and my oral presentation and last but not least I would like to convey my appreciation for Sudin because he has become my English lecturer ever since he was uh, I hope you always stay safe sir and see you soon. Thank you.